Breaking news, ladies and gentlemen. I am spectacular, the silver stacular. That's not the breaking news. The breaking news is this little green bean, this little green sticker, the CAC sticker that we see on coins is about to make headlines in the numismatic world because the company CAC is about to begin their own coin grading service. So NGC, PCGS, two of the big ones, CAC puts their sticker on those slabs. Now, CAC is going to put stickers on their own slabs. I'm not sure what's going to happen, but there is an article in Coin World, and we're going to read that together right now. And it goes, CAC grading service planned for start in 2023. And it reads, A growing call for improvement in third-party grading of U.S. coins is being addressed with the formation of CAC grading service, which will begin operation in the first quarter of 2023. The new company will form from the existing Certified Acceptance Corp, which has been certifying third-party quality grading and authenticity since 2007. You know, it's barely, let's be honest, that company right there is barely known. Nobody really, you know, recognizes that. PCGS, NGC are the two big ones, but I'd imagine that CAC is going to go ahead and be a third large company when it goes live in 2023. When I started CAC in 2007, starting another grading company was the last thing on my mind, said John Albanese. Over time, we've gotten a mandate from the collectors and dealers. We've seen many of the higher price coins submitted to us, but for some who wanted the CAC service, it became impractical for them to pay two grading fees and essentially four shipping fees for some of the coins. Where there wasn't a niche for CAC services, this will allow a one-stop shop option for those coins. According to Albanese, CAC grading service is composed of over 125 strategic partners who are professionals in numismatics as well as influential collectors, which represents a business model that differs from the two largest firms that are owned by private equity companies. This is going to be a true team effort, Albanese said. Everyone is going to be contributing. The service will initially be offered to existing CAC members who will be contacted by letter. The 3,000 members will be informed of the initial service plans for upcoming services. We'll be rolling out world-class registry set program, said Albanese. There will be a global set that will include coins from all graders, but we will also have our own CAC registry sets exclusive for CAC coins. Exclusively for CAC coins, excuse me. Albany said the company is assembling what he termed the best team of graders possible, driven by strong grading sets that can help the public develop a better understanding of a coin's grade and achieve customer satisfaction in the outcome. The company will publish its standards, though there are certain coins where the only photos are available in some of the higher mint set grades make grading tougher. Every major show will feature multiple CAC grading sets on display, Albany said, a practice he encouraged for others. The initial focus will be U.S. coins. Without experts in the field, you're not offering the quality you need for the service. Our partners love the U.S. coins and have enough to tackle that right now. There are currently no immediate plans to include paper money or to offer conservation services, as some competitors do. CAC grading service will be based in Virginia Beach, Virginia, but the current New Jersey-based office will remain open and provide services even after the start of the new company. I have a 10-year contract to spend one week a month in Virginia Beach, and I'll be there in New Jersey for tiebreakers. We'll have customer service in both locations. We have a great product currently with great people, and this will make that even better. Creation of the CAC grading service is not expected to diminish the value of coins already graded by other grading services and bearing the CAC stickers, he said. These coins are welcome in our registry set as they are, said Albanese. So the owners don't need to do anything differently. We're going to let the market react to the news. Many of the coins we've seen are among the most expensive coins. It's not the coin that earned the sticker. You buy the coin and not the holder. We will be phasing out the stickers over time. That's fascinating, is it not? So boom, there it is. We will be phasing out the stickers over time. So if you have a coin with a green bean on it or a gold bean, you might want to go ahead and hold on to that for dear life. And if you see one at a coin show, you might want to give that a second thought when it comes to buying it. I can imagine that these right here will go up in price uh, significantly over time, although they already are significantly more expensive uh, when it has a green bean on there. 
I could imagine that increasing soon, especially once they get rid of that. It'll be a time that's you know no longer exists in the numismatic world, and it's going to be something we're going to remember. The green beans, and uh, whether you liked it or you didn't, it's just something that existed and may have more value for that little tiny green sticker. Anyways, that's the news. CAC will be creating their in a whole new grading service, right in 2023. Excited or not, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Spectacular, though, is out. Well, hello, everybody. I seek to educate and entertain through my journey of collecting coins and stacking precious metals. I encourage you to subscribe, and please stay with me on this journey. I am Spectacular, the Silver Stacular.